in everything give thanks for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. 1 Thessalonians 5.18 Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and this is basically an, an Hawaiian inspired makeup look that I did when I was going out with my friends the other day and I hope you guys enjoy it. Always making sure that they better than you, but as you they do me, go go do you. You cannot steal my joy, moo moo. I say some people. Starting with my Kiko matte base primer, and then going with my Scandinavia oil controlling primer just to give it a bit of moisture, because the Kiko one mats me out there. And then I'm going to use the sellotape and apply my Urban Decay eyeshadow primer. And then the first eyeshadow I'm using is from Colourpop. This is Bandit, and I'm just going to put this in my crease and close to my eyebrows. I can't avoid putting it close to my eyebrows anyway. And then I'm going to go in with Chickadee to kind of soften that up a little bit. I'm then going to go with Morocco in the same place, but I'm using a smaller brush to put it in. And then I'm alternating with the other brush I used to apply Bandit to blend it out because I didn't want to put it everywhere so I just used the small brush to put it where I really wanted and the other brush to kind of blend it out. Okay guys so I'm going to do that to the other side and remember to just keep blending, blending reapplying, blending, reapplying, blending to the intensity that you want and that was what I did for my own look as you can see I kept going in and blending and applying and blending I'm then gonna go in with my Morphe palette I'm gonna take these two shades the one is really really brown and the other one is a darker brown and I'm just gonna apply it to that same place that I applied Morocco <coughs> sorry and then I'm gonna blend it also so yeah yes so i'm then gonna take in chickadee again and i'm gonna apply on my lid and basically i'm applying i'm blending out my crease to define it applying it again and again and then what i'm gonna do is also take my morphe palette and I'm gonna apply the shade which is gonna be shown soon and I'm gonna apply that over the place where I applied chickadee just to intensify that color just a little bit so I'm gonna keep going in with that um, shade for Morphe and I'm gonna keep applying it and also blending my crease because I want everything to be smooth for what is coming next and basically I'm using my Maybelline um, 24 hours day setting spray and this small brush which I spritz with the Maybelline and then I dipped it into that loose glitter from eBay and can you see that glitter? you have to be really careful and remember to just blend your crease um, so that you don't have um, glitter on your crease because I wanted that place to be very clean and I just wanted the glitter to be mainly focused on my lid as you can see. I'm then going to go in with my Inglot Gel Liner in shade 77 and just give me a very nice wing. Okay, so with that same liner brush, I'm just going to use the product that's left on the brush to kind of line my waterline. Um, I didn't add any more products and that's just because I didn't want my waterline to be too thick. And then I'm going to go in with my Morphe palette and use this brown shade. And I'm going to use a small pencil brush to apply it 
on my crease just to darken my crease a bit and then I'm gonna use that same brush I've been using to blend to just blend okay guys so due to all the blending some of the glitter has vacated the premises and so I'm just going back in with the same setting spray the same loose glitter and I'm just intensifying my glitter and then I'm gonna go in with my L'Oreal true match foundation and my Estee Lauder foundation and I'm gonna mix them together and apply them with my face because I like the mixture <laughs> Okay, so after applying foundation, I'm going to use my NYX Conceal Correct and Contour Palette to highlight my face and I'm using two shades to highlight and I'm using my foundation brush to apply it and then I'm going in with my Beauty Blender to kind of blend it in better, yeah? And after that, I'm going to go in with my MAC Select Concealer to um, just build up the color that I used under my eyes, my forehead and my chin and also onto my contour okay so I'm gonna go in with that dark shade and use that as my contour and then as you can see you can still see the line but of my concealer under my contour but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use my the brush I used for my foundation I'm gonna use that to blend my contour and blend the concealer together as you can see <laughs> I'm gonna use my Sasha Buttercup setting powder to set everywhere that I highlighted or concealed in a sense. I am then gonna go in with my Miss Forty liner in black and I'm gonna apply this on my wing line just to make it a bit darker because the powder I applied yeah rubbed it off yes then going in with makeup cake cocoa bear and also morocco and poppy I mixed morocco and poppy together I'm gonna just use this to smoke my bottom washes out yeah <laughs> Now focusing on my brow, as usual, I use this eyebrow pencil I got from Ghana on the outside of my brow and then I go in with my NYX eyebrow pencil for the inner part and also to blend everything together and then I used my LA Girls Pro HD concealer in Toffee to just clean it up just a little bit as you can see. So now I'm going in with my slick contour palette. I'm just going to use this to set everywhere I contoured with. And then I'm going to go in with my collection pressed powder to just clean my face up. Uh, yeah. After that, I'm going to apply my MAC blush in Femme Noir 
and I'm gonna just use this as a blush but also to intensify my contour and then I'm gonna be alternating with the brush I use to clean up my set my Sasha buttercup and also my blush brush just to soften it up Okay, so after applying my brush, I'm going in with my Skin Dunia Setting Spray and then I'm going to apply my Primark bronzer as a highlight and I prefer applying my bronzer after I spritz my face. I'm also going to go in with my Laura Geller highlight in Ballerina and I'm just going to use this on my forehead and my nose. Yeah, and then I'm gonna go in again with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit and I'm gonna use a smaller brush to apply that on my eyebrows, also on my lid, my cupid's bow and the tip of my nose and then I'm taking a clean brush to just brush everything out and everything together. Using my natural collection lip liner, I'm gonna line my lips and then I'm gonna go in with Colourpop Liquid Lipstick K from the Karichi collection all over my lips and then B part in the middle of my lips just to soften it a bit basically and then last but not least I'm just gonna spritz my face with Maybelline's um, 24 hour setting spray and we are done I'm gonna comb my hair out change my top and I'll be back okay guys so this is the finished look i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'm sorry it was long but it had to be um don't forget to like share subscribe share with your friends your family your auntie your brothers everyone and like comment on the video and i will see you in my next video bye